sounds. This is a huge moment for NASA. After travelling for billions of miles through the solar system, the OSIRIS-REx capsule and its precious sample of the asteroid Bennu is finally on the ground in the Utah desert. For the recovery team, it's a race against time to secure the craft because you don't want any contamination from the ground here, the dust, the dirt, the microbes, to get mixed up with the bits of Bennu. So the big question is, why go to all of this effort? The first reason is a big one. Bennu tops the list of NASA's most hazardous space rocks. But if you know what the asteroid is made of, then it can give you ideas about how to stop it should we ever need to. But Bennu is not all bad. In fact, the asteroid could tell us about our origin because Bennu is a relic from the formation of the early solar system four and a half billion years ago. It's like a perfectly preserved time capsule. Now, when the spacecraft took the sample in a five second long smash and grab, scientists think it picked up about 250 grams of rock and dust and every single grain of this will be studied by scientists. First though, they have to get the capsule to a clean room and then they'll begin the painstaking process of opening it. It's going to take a few weeks to finally reveal what's inside, but scientists say the wait will be worth it.